Certified Professional in Accessibility Core Competencies CPACC Real Exam Questions are online. With them, you can pass the CPACC test in a short time. 1. An impairment in the ability to receive, send, process, and comprehend concepts or verbal, nonverbal, and graphic symbol systems is most commonly associated with which type of disorder? A. Communication B. Perceptual C. Dysphagia D. Visual 2. Which is a systemic benefit of sharing accessibility successes within an organization? A. Ensuring management budgets for additional resources B. Ensuring practical knowledge can be used for the next project C. Leveraging the successes in annual performance reviews D. Publicizing accessibility in public relations campaigns and activities 3. Which set of assistive technologies and adaptive strategies is best suited for a person with hearing, auditory disabilities? A. Augmentative and Alternative Communication AAC, Devices Highlighting Simplified Content B. Haptic Alerts Captions Transcripts C. Screen Magnifiers Color and Contrast Controls Magnified Pointers and Cursors D. Screen Reader Braille Keyboard Speech Input 4. The purpose of the Universal Design for Learning curriculum is to help students master a. A uniform curricula b. A particular body of knowledge c. Specific sets of skills d. Learning itself 5. Why is government procurement law an important driver in making accessible ICT commercially available? a. Governments are the largest purchaser of ICT which moves industry to build accessible ICT. b. Industry must conform to government laws. c. Industry trends are leading indicators of government practices, which lowers costs. d. Regional disability lobbyists can apply pressure to government procurement. 6. A person who struggles with organization of numbers, has trouble with counting principles, or has difficulty telling time may have which disability? A. Dyscalculia B. Dysgraphia C. Dysphagia D. Dyspraxia 7. Which statement is true regarding the Japan Industrial Standards, G's, requirements for accessibility, G's x8341? A. G's X8341 follows WCAG 2.0. B. G's X8341 requires government IT procurements to be accessible. C. G's X8341 permits lawsuits against Japanese companies that fail to develop accessible IT products. D. G's X8341 is a standard followed on a consensual basis by industry. 8. What process best assists in determining individualized accommodations or adjustments? A. Asking family members B. Asking in a job interview C. Performing needs assessment D. Touring other facilities 9. Persons with a disability are most likely to experience what major factor that could lead to poverty? a. Fewer skills b. Lower employment rates c. Lower marriage prospects d. Lower participation in social activities 10. Which example best illustrates how accessibility solutions can be incorporated into user experience design? A. 
Adding accessibility to a website when a user asks for accommodation or adjustment. B. Attaching an accessibility statement to a website. C. Designing a website for people who use assistive technology. D. Redirecting the user to another accessible site.